Hello everyone, it's Annie and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use iMovie in case you guys want to start your own LPS channels and you do not know how to edit. So this editor, it came with my computer. I have a Mac. Ugh, that's my dog. She constantly wants love. She's a little diva. Now, while I'm scratching my dog, I will explain you guys how to use OBS. Was it small? Is that you? Ugh. <laughs> okay, so did I say OBS? I meant iMovie. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use my sister's um I'm gonna use my sister's video that she made and we're going to like fiddle around in with iMovie in it. So if you don't know how to go to so you're gonna go to applications and if you don't know how to go to applications, you can go to you go to go and then click on applications. And then here is iMovie, so you can just load that up. And once you have it open, you will see this. This is how you can start editing. Here are all of my videos that I have had. Pay no attention to that one. Hopefully I can, uplo um, can upload that one, but now we're not. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on Create New, then you're going to click on Movie. Then you're going to wait for it to load. And then once it loads, you're going to import your media. So what you can do, the easiest way is to download your f videos onto the desktop. Then just drag and drop. And there you go. And then it's, it looks, it's going to be hard to edit. If you know what I mean. And it's 9 minutes long and it's that small. So what you're going to do, is going to click on view. And you're going to click on zoom in there now you can Bella enough with the barking fine I'll let you back up again so now what you now what you're going to do is you want to skip over the part you want to skip over this part so if you want to skip over a certain part I'm, what I'm trying to say if you want to cut a part out you can right click then you have to move it to where you want it. Then you can click right click, split clip, and then you can click on it and, and press delete on the tab and then on the keyboard and then it'll disappear. So now that you know how to delete clips, <coughs> cut and delete, <coughs> what we're going to do is you're going to do audio. And then there's a bunch, and then there's like a bunch of sound effects. And also music, but I'm not going to show any of the music right now. <coughs> if you want to get better music, you can go to Creator Studio. I'll show that later. Now, titles. This is just titles. If you want to add a... T so what you do is you can click on a title, drag it, and then you can... <coughs> my computer's lagging. And then you can... Like... Drag it a bit. Ugh. Maybe it's really lagging. <sighs> what you can do is you can, when you see this, you can drag it a bit. It won't let me drag it. There, see? You can drag it for how long you want it in the video. Then you can click on it. Then just click on here. Delete. Then you can write whatever you want. Test there and it'll show on the video test what you can also do is I've never really experimented with this stuff but I think you can change the color I think I'm not sure my sister's changed the color yeah you can change the color if you want and I don't know what this oh that's for to make the letters bigger this is to make them um, these are to do that don't know what that is so don't go ex so um yeah you can just fiddle around with this stuff so now we're going to delete that <laughs> now backgrounds i don't really know what backgrounds do fully but i know that you can like i don't really know what the backgrounds do 
all I know is that they are backgrounds and that you can use them for green screens and stuff like that. This is blobs, so blob around underwater curtain. So yeah, you could like do a background and then you can use a title and you can create an intro if you like. So that's also cool. Transitions are really, really cool. So what you do is, if you want to like make a transition, like if you want to make a transition, transition like right here, what you can do is you can just drag and drop, and then then it'll do the transition. That's that was a blur transition. Or you can do this transition, and then it'll do that. So yeah, it's pretty simple and easy. <laughs> so that's how you pretty, pretty much edit. Now we're going to go on to these tools, which are the fun ones. Let me just delete that. My dog wants belly rubs again. One second. Okay, now we're done. <sighs> okay. Let's go to a tool that I think is really nice that they added. So what you're going to need, you're just going to put a clip on the top of one, then this thing will show up. If you click on it, you can click on cutaway, then you can click on green slash blue screen, which will make everything that's green or blue like show what's going on over here. Or you could do split screen. We'll click on split screen then you're gonna do right then you can like it's not working for some reason um i think for some reason it's not working but yeah what you're gonna do or picture within a picture okay it is maybe you gotta do it over here um blue. Uh, split picture. Oh, <laughs> there's. You can see that it's split. You can see that it's split. Then you can do right. Then you can do top, top and bottom. So then you can do picture within a picture. And so here it is. You can make it bigger. And you can make a zoom swap. You know whatever you want. Whatever floats your boat. And yeah, it's pretty simple. Okay, now that we explored that option, we're going to explore. We're going to explore this option. So this option, if we click on it here, mm, I haven't really fiddled around with it. So let's match color. And I don't really know what this stuff is, so you guys can fiddle around. And this, oh, this is really good. If your video is too dark, you can just click this and make it lighter. Or if your video is too light, you can just make it darker. Or like this. You know, whatever floats your boat. And this is really cool. You can make it different colors, black and white. Like pop, the colors, you can make the colors pop. My dog is moaning. And you can make everything blue or yellow. You know, it's a pretty cool tool. And next is this, which is which is like a zoom in. So you can take the sides and you can zoom in to where you want. There you can zoom in. Or or if you want to show it actually zooming in, then you can do this. You can click on start and zoom in to where you want it and then this to no wait <laughs> I did the wrong way so you click on start and then you just so you take the end and you zoom in to where you want to where you want it and you can take this and just take it when you want it where you want it to start Try to okay. Okay, so then it should work. 
I think. Did I do it on this? I wasn't fully on this. Oh, wait. I think it was. So, let's see. Let's see. Where was it? It should be here. You see? Zooming in. <laughs> zooming in. <laughs> yeah, so that's how you can zoom in. <laughs> now. <coughs> The next clip we are gonna do is this. You can stabilize your shaky video if you shake your camera a lot. This is how you can adjust the audio. Okay, Bella, stop licking my arm. You go down there. Tintin wants some company. And this is how you can reduce background noise. This is how you can speed up a video so you can go slow and then your video will show this turtle icon and then it will be slow or if you want it to be fast then you can go fast and then or and you can like choose how fast you want it to be or how slow or freeze frame. I've never tried that one. Um, or custom, you know, whatever floats your boat. So now that we're done, now we're going to split a clip again. <coughs> okay, now this. This one's really good. So you can do like audio effects and you can make it go pitch up, pitch. You can go like pitch up pitch down, small room, and telephone, you know, whatever you want. <coughs> and it is loading. You know, whatever, whatever really floats your boat. I don't really care. Well, I do care, but, you know. So then this is clip filter. This is awesome, guys. So it got gives you all of this stuff. This is no. This is flipped. This is black and white. This is Nor. This is Silent Era. This is Cosmo. Heatwave. Blockbuster. Vintage. Western. Film grain. Angled film. Senpai. Vintage. Romantic. Cartoon. Blue. Blast. Hard light. Blade bypass, glow, old world, flashback, dreamy, register, ra register, day into night, X-ray, vintage, I don't know what this is, sci-fi, and I don't know what this is either. So yeah, those are pretty cool and pretty useful, <laughs> and. This, I don't really know what it does. So you can like click on this and you can hide. And I think that hides those things. My computer's talking so much. <laughs> okay. And then can like shoot. I don't know what that stuff really does. Okay, so now that you um have gotten, now that you've edited your video, what you want to do is you click this, you click file or YouTube. If it can't upload to YouTube, then just download it to a file and then go to your channel and then upload it from there. And so when when you click on this, you're gonna have to do make a you're gonna have to um do a title, description, and tags. Tags are really important because tags are what people search. So, yeah, now I'm going to show you guys how to, now I'm going to show you guys how to get some really cool music. Okay, guys, what you're going to do is you're going to want to click on Creator Studio. <laughs> then you got all your videos, you're going to go and create. Then you got some really, 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 really cool music, but for some of them... You have to include this in the description so people, other people can find it. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. 
I had fun recording this. I hope you had fun watching this. And if you did, leave a like and a comment. And be sure to subscribe and become a kaiki today. Bye!